Welcome to Today in Nerd History for May 22nd. The Star Trek The Next Generation episode, Second Chances, aired May 22, 1993. In this episode, Riker's exact duplicate is discovered on Nirvala 4. His first order of business. Resume his relationship with Deanna. Second order. Obey orders from his superior, himself. The Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode, The Collaborator, aired May 22, 1994. In this episode, Vedek Barrel is targeted by fellow Kai candidate, Vedek Wynn, as having been a collaborator with the Cardassians during the occupation. The Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode, Shakar, aired May 22, 1995. In this episode, news arrives that Kai Wynn has also become Bay Jor's political leader. She asks Kira to negotiate with an old resistance friend about returning soil reclamators. The Star Trek Voyager episode, Learning Curve, aired May 22, 1995. In this episode, as Neelix is cooking, sickens Voyager itself. Tuvok runs the foremost, problematic Maquis malcontents, through a Starfleet-style, boot camp. The Star Trek Enterprise episode, Shockwave, aired May 22, 2002. In this episode, the Enterprise discovers a mining colony of the Paragans. The crew gets an invitation for a meeting on the surface and a shuttle pod tries to break through the atmosphere. The Doctor Who episode, The Hungry Earth, aired May 22, 2010. In this episode, when a drill, drills too deep, into the Earth, something that had been hibernating beneath the Earth's crust, is woken, and it's hungry, for revenge. Arthur Conan Doyle, was born May 22, 1859, and passed away, July 7, 1930. Arthur Ignatius Conan Doyle was a British writer and physician. He created the character Sherlock Holmes in 1887 for a study in Scarlet, the first of four novels and 56 short stories about Holmes and Dr. Watson. The Sherlock Holmes stories are milestones in the field of crime fiction. Doyle was a prolific writer. Other than Holmes stories, his works include fantasy and science fiction stories about Professor Challenger and humorous stories about the Napoleonic soldier Brigadier Gerard, as well as plays, romances, poetry, non-fiction, and historical novels. One of Doyle's early short stories, J. Habakkuk Jefferson's Statement, in 1884, helped to popularize the mystery of the Mary Celeste. Michael Constantine, was born May 22, 1927 and passed away, August 31, 2021. Michael Constantine, born Gus F. Strachew, was an American actor. He is most widely recognized for his portrayal of Costas, Gus, Portokalos, the Windex bottle-toting Greek father of Tula Portokalos, in the movie My Big Fat Greek Wedding in 2002. Earlier, he earned acclaim for his TV work, especially as the long-suffering high school principal, Seymour Kaufman, on ABC's comedy drama, Room 222, for which he won the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series in 1970. He was again recognized by the Emmy Awards as well as the Golden Globe Awards, the following year. After the conclusion of Room 222, Constantine played Night Court Magistrate Matthew J. Sirota on the 1976 sitcom Sirota's Court, receiving his second Golden Globe nomination. Constantine reprised his role as Gus Portokalos in My Big Fat Greek Wedding 2 in 2016. Remembering Paul Winfield, born May 22, 1939, and passed away, March 7, 2004. Paul Winfield was an American actor, best known to Star Trek fans for playing Captain Clark Terrell in Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan, and Captain Dathan in the Star Trek The Next Generation episode, Darmok, in 1991. He was in, roughly, 125 movies and TV shows. 
Among the roles for which he is known, are his Academy Award-nominated, portrayal of a Depression-era Louisiana sharecropper, in the 1973 movie Sounder, and his Emmy Award-nominated performance, as Dr. Martin Luther King, in the 1978 miniseries, King. He is also known, for his supporting roles in such movies as, The Terminator, and Mars Attacks, and for narrating, the A&E series, City Confidential. He was also in the second season, Babylon 5 episode, Gropos, as General Richard Franklin, the father of regular character, Dr. Stephen Franklin. Happy birthday Richard Benjamin, born May 22, 1938. He has starred in a number of well-known movie productions, including Goodbye Columbus in 1969, Catch-22 in 1970, Westworld in 1973 and The Sunshine Boys in 1975. In the TV series Quark, he played Adam Quark. After directing for TV, Benjamin's first feature as director was the 1982 comedy, My Favorite Year, for which star, Peter O'Toole, was nominated for an Oscar award. His other movies as a director include, City Heat in 1984, Made in America, and, The Money Pit in 1986. Happy Birthday Ann Cusick, born May 22, 1961. She played Maggie, in the Star Trek Enterprise episode, Carbon Creek. She is the sister of noted actors, John and Joan Cusick. She has been in such movies as, A League of Their Own, The Birdcage, Multiplicity, Gross Point Blank, Tank Girl, Stigmata, and, My Fellow Americans. She was in the miniseries, From the Earth to the Moon, playing Pat Armstrong, then wife of Neil Armstrong. She has also made guest appearances on, Boston Legal, Frasier, Grey's Anatomy, Bones, Six Feet Under, and her sister's series, What About Joan? In Charmed, she played Miss Donovan, in the episodes, Charmed Noir, and, Carpe Demon. Happy Birthday Noah Tishby, born May 22, 1977. She is the actress who played, Corporal Amanda Cole, in the Star Trek Enterprise episode, Harbinger. Born in Ramat Aviv, Tel Aviv, Israel, she is very popular as both an actress and singer in her native country of Israel. She has made guest appearances on such popular TV series as, The Drew Carey Show, CSI Miami, Nip Tuck, The 4400, NCIS, Leverage, and Valentine. In Charmed, she played Black Heart, in the episode, Malice in Wonderland. She had a supporting role in the 2005 science fiction movie, The Island. Happy Birthday Shirley Bond, born May 22, 1934. She is the actress, who appeared in Star Trek The Original Series, playing the woman, known only as Ruth, in the episode, Shore Leave. She was the star of the, short-lived, 1960s sitcom, My Sister Eileen. She also had an, uncredited role, in the 1963 movie, The Wheeler Dealers. Happy Birthday, Mark Christopher Lawrence, born May 22, 1964. He is an American actor, stand-up comedian, and voiceover artist. He is known for his role as DJ, Tone Deaf, in the 1994 comedy, Fear of a Black Hat. He has co-starred in popular movies, such as, Terminator 2 Judgment Day, Tales from the Hood, Planet of the Apes, Lost Treasure, and, The Pursuit of Happiness. He is perhaps, best known, for his role as, Big Mike, on the NBC series, Chuck. He has made guest appearances on many TV shows, most notably, Heroes, My Name is Earl, Crossing Jordan, Dharma and Greg, Malcolm in the Middle, Touched by an Angel, Malcolm and Eddie, Men Behaving Badly, Seinfeld, Murphy Brown, Good Luck Charlie, and Martin. He is also featured on the radio series, Adventures in Odyssey, as, Ed Washington. Remembering David Hillary Hughes, born May 22, 1901, and passed away, February 5, 1974. He played, Trophane, in the Star Trek The Original Series episode, Errand of Mercy.
Happy birthday Cameron Bikondova, born May 22, 1999. Cameron Renee Bikondova is an American actress and dancer, best known for playing a young Selena Kyle, Catwoman, on the TV series, Gotham. Remembering Michael Sarazin, born May 22, 1940, and passed away April 17, 2011. He is perhaps best known for starring opposite Jane Fonda in the critically acclaimed 1969 movie They Shoot Horses, Don't They? He played Trevine in the Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode The Quickening. Happy birthday, Gary Casper, born May 22, 1958. He played an Orion slaver in the Star Trek Enterprise episode Borderland. Remembering Jack Keller, born May 22, 1946 and passed away, May 7, 2022. He was an American actor, probably best known for his role of Marty, a landlord in The Big Lebowski. He was also in Men in Black 2, The Last Boy Scout, Point Break, Wyatt Earp, and Waterworld. He played Jaheel in the Star Trek Deep Space Nine episode, Babel. Well, that's it for today, folks. I appreciate you listening, and uh, if you enjoyed the show, please feel free to tell your friends about uh, little old me here. Have a wonderful day.